Today, we're going to balance the equation of N2O5 gas plus H2O, which is water, and this will produce or yield nitric acid, which is HNO3. So I already wrote down a chart for us and the elements that we see on both sides of the equations. All we have to do is just write down how many we have. So I see that I have a 2 for the nitrogen, right? So I have 2 nitrogen. I have an oxygen here, and I have an oxygen over here on my reactant side. So I just have to make sure that I add those numbers. I have 5 oxygens plus 1 oxygen here. So 5 plus 1 is a total of 6 oxygens. And then the hydrogens, there's 2 here, right? 2 goes to the hydrogen, so I have 2. On my product side, I have a H here. There's only one, right? There's no subscript. So I have one hydrogen. The same thing goes with the nitrogen. I just have one, right? No subscript. And then I have three oxygens. So I put a three here. Now, always work with one element at a time. Doesn't matter. Always pick the easiest one, though. Maybe I can balance the nitrogens, right? So it seems like I want to put a number in front of this compound in order to turn it into the number that I want. In this case, 1 times what will get us to 2? Yeah, 1 times 2, right? And the number that you say that you times it by is the number that goes in front of the compound. But whenever you do that, you have to play fair. You have to distribute that 2 by multiplication to all the elements in that compound. So I'm going to change my hydrogen, nitrogen, and oxygen number. I have 2 hydrogens now, so I'm going to cancel out the one I'm going to put a 2. I have 2 nitrogens. That's what we did here, so I'll put a 2 here. And then 2 times 3 is 6, so I just put a 6 here. And oh, look at that. By balancing one element, we balance them all. So this one's done, guys. I'm just going to erase this. But other than that, this is the balanced equation. I have 1 N2O5 plus 1 H2O, which will yield me 2 HNO3s. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Like and subscribe, which will help us out. And I will see you guys all in the next lesson. Have an awesome day. Bye.